Welcome everyone, Dr. Mandel here. The simplest soap, the least expensive soap, that's all you need. That in water and that will kill the coronavirus. If you haven't subscribed, please do so and hit that bell to get all future notifications for my upcoming videos to help you and your family. And when this virus is absorbed in our eyes, nose or mouth, it changes its genetic code. It starts to mutate. It starts to become very aggressive and it starts to multiply. This coronavirus is not a living organism. It's a protein molecule and it disintegrates and dies on its own. The disintegration time depends on many factors like temperature, humidity, and the type of material where it lies. But this virus is very fragile and the only thing that protects it is the outer layer of fat. And that's why any soap or detergent is the best remedy because the foam cuts the fat. And that's why you have to rub your hands and fingers together for 20 seconds or more. And that's what's gonna dissolve the fat layer, destructing the virus. What's really interesting is that heat melts fat. The magic number is 77 degrees Fahrenheit. When you wash your hands or your clothes, make sure the temperature is above 77 degrees. The warmer the temperature, the more foam and suds that you're going to have. So the hotter the water, that creates more foam and that makes it even more useful to kill the virus. So if it's your hand sanitizer or even alcohol, anything over 65% alcohol is going to kill the virus much easier. Any mix with one part bleach and five parts water directly dissolves the protein. It breaks it down from the inside. Remember that this is a virus. Antibiotics will not work on viruses. They will only work on bacteria. This virus can live three hours on fabric and porous materials. Never shake used or unused clothing, sheets or cloth. While it is glued to a porous surface, it is very inert and disintegrates only. It remains four hours on copper and wood, 24 hours on cardboard, and up to 72 hours on hard surfaces like steel and plastic. This virus cannot go through healthy skin. Our largest organ is our skin. So if you touch the virus, you need to wash your hands with water and soap for at least 20 seconds or use a hand sanitizer. Our worst habit is touching our face. Put a mask on until you break that habit. This will at least prevent you from touching your nose and mouth. Remember, your eyes are still exposed, so be careful. Always wash your hands before and after, touching food, locks, knobs, switches, remote control, cell phones, watches, computers, desks, TV, and especially when using the bathroom. Too much washing your hands and too much hand sanitizer with that alcohol will cause those micro cracks in our hands. Those molecules can hide in those cracks. So make sure you use a good, thick moisturizer. I know this is frustrating, but you must think things through from beginning to end. Have that present time consciousness, knowing where you are all the time. When you're away from your home, and there's people there, or people have been there, treat it as a virus. Wash your hands if you can, or use hand sanitizer as soon as possible. We're all going to get through this pandemic, but we must be smart. Please pass this video on to your friends and family. Leave your comments below, and most important, make it a great day. I'm Dr. Alan Mandel.